I'm talking about what we do in the first session, part one of the Python bootcamp, which is for two days. Uh, the, in the first class, we understand how the infrastructure works. You need to make an account on Azure Notebook, so you have to go to notebook.azure.com and you have to sign in with your Microsoft password. Once you sign in, then you have to click on the library link. The link of the library is given on the web page. It's given here. It's also given on the meetup page. Once you clone the library, you will have my library, and if you see here, 51 people have cloned. Once you have this library, then you can go through all these links if you already know a little bit of Python. Otherwise, you have to search for one day bootcamp. That's day one, because this has day one and day two. This also has the exploratory data analysis 101, also capstone. 101, Regression 101, and some other files. So what our interest is, part one file. So when you open the part one file, you see Jupyter on the left. Jupyter Notebook uh, is a cloud-based uh, platform to run uh, Python on the cloud. We are right now on the Azure cloud. The cloud is provided by Microsoft. It's uh, They have given us a dedicated computer with RAM and all of the libraries that we need already installed, which is kind of very good for us. So Azure Notebook is given by Microsoft. Uh, it's online. Whenever you run this, you use their computation power. It's a slow computer, but it still gets the job done. Um, whatever code we write in one block, and then when we press run, that code gets executed. So I'm executing the first one. It says X is not defined because I never defined X. Then we do print command, then we do variable assignment, uh, functions, uh, functions with different argument, string functions like push and pop and split and trim. Then we do list manipulation like pop and append. Then we do if and else and then loop, uh, for loop and while loop. And then we do dictionaries. Uh, more functions, then we switch to lambda functions, um, and uh, then we switch to a little bit of matplotlib. Then we do a little bit of pandas data frame, and uh, at the end we do more questions of data frame and data frame manipulation, which is wrangling, data wrangling and uh, exporting and importing data and cleaning the data. Uh, then we understand how to work with uh, the data frames and filtering. And uh, then we see how to export data in CSV or in a pickle file. Uh, we also look at the series object and some features of data wrangling like melting and pivoting. And then we do a small project where we choose a data of your choice. So generally there are two to three people in the class. So I ask them to get me their data. So if somebody is working in any of the field, we prepare a dummy data and run the analysis of what we learned in the class at the end of the class. So this is in very short what we do in the Python day one. Uh, you can check out my notebook and try to prepare yourself. Make an account on azure.notebook.com and be prepared for the session. See you in the session. Thank you for watching.